Hello everybody and welcome to another episode of Tech Motoring. On today's episode, we have the Electrify America Home Station Level 2 Home Charger. This just came out this past week and I am so excited to open up this box and see what we have. This has been a long time coming. I've been waiting for Electrify America to release their home charger and it's finally here. So hit that subscribe button and stay tuned because we're about to dive right in. All right, well, here we are. Let's go ahead and open it up and see what we are greeted with here. All right, well, actually, I'm gonna, I'm gonna turn this around. You guys gotta see this. Ah. All right, here we are. So here we go. The power of home charging looks like a little uh, like poster, I guess you can use it as. Power of home charging, that's pretty cool. Let's just say, install, charge, and enjoy the power to move. Very nice. All right, let's put that to the side real quick. All right, so it looks like we have a quick start guide here. This is, this is beautiful, by the way. Look at this. I mean, it's just cardboard, but man, they really put a lot of effort into letting this present itself when you open the box. I mean, this is amazing. All right, so it looks like there's a get started booklet here. And then step one, get started. And then level two charging. So this is all the installation stuff. So this is actually the same manual you can actually download from their website. Um, but this is beautiful in color. I mean, this is really, really nice. But you're not here to see books. You're here to see the charger. So let's keep going. Okay, so let's go ahead and take out the styrofoam. Oh, that is, that is beautiful. Here, let me tilt this up for you here. That is absolutely beautiful. All right, well, let's, um, let's take it out piece by piece. And then we'll lay it out on this table and, and see what we have here. So that is the, uh, the holster case. So this is where you wrap your cable around when this is mounted to the wall. And then that's where your plug end plugs into your the J1772 plug that plugs into here. And then this is actually part of that. And then here is the charger. Oh, it's actually tied all in with the cables, of course. Oh, all right. So there's that. I'm going to put it on the floor for now. And what do we got here? Oh, the bracket, the hanging bracket. And, of course, some of the hardware. And that appears to be all that's in this box. So let's get this box out of the way. And let's lay it out on the table. All right, well, here it is, the level two charger itself. Oh, let's turn that here. Now let's let's get some, uh, we're gonna get some close up shots of this as well, but let's go ahead and get this out of the packaging here. So this appears to be the J1772. Oh, look at that. Let's see if I can get that close for you. It's uh it's it's not very like fancy. It's it's very just simple. There's not even any writing on it. Um I thought they would have at least had their uh their logo on it or something, but no, it's just a very basic um handle that they're using here. Um Yeah, I can not much to say about it. J1772, of course. So let's go ahead and uh put that down. This is obviously the uh, the NEMA plug, so if you're going to do a NEMA 1450 outlet, this is the plug for that. Um, and as you can see, that goes into this side right here. Uh, and the J1772 is coming out of this side here, and then that's that 20-something foot cord. I think it's about 23 feet, if I'm not mistaken. Um, 
so that is really really nice the cord seems to be not super thick actually i thought it would be a little thicker but it's actually pretty good it, it's pliable um, obviously that'll be better once we start doing some testing on this uh, let's go ahead and um, peel this back real quick oh that is beautiful look at that so it says a towel design i don't know if, what that exactly means if that's um, an italian company that maybe designed this shape but it looks, I mean, it looks great. I mean, I, I, there's really not much. It's black, it's sleek. I know this is an LED light in the middle here. So that'll actually light up uh, once we get it plugged in. So I do want to get inside of this too for this unboxing so we can take a look at it a little bit deeper. Um, in the meantime, let's take a look at some of the other little things real quick here. So once again, this is the, um, the holster for the J1772. It's also a, a cable holder as well, so you can wrap the cable around this, so this mounts to your wall like so. And then this is just kind of a, uh, a sleek little cover that snaps in there like that, and that's where your J1772 goes into. So this would go up on the wall like this, and then when you're done charging your car, you take your J1772 adapter, plug it in like that, and there you go. It is snapped in, and of course your cable would be wrapped around this simple design but simple is good you know and i like the thing i like about these is that if you want to put your charger up high in a wall let's say like mine's going to be pretty high up like the ones that have just the ability to wrap the cable around the charger itself i never liked that idea um and i always liked having a kind of like a separate little mount for it uh, so this way you can kind of put this wherever you want on the wall, keep the charger up and out of the way. And when I do my install video, you're going to see exactly that. You're going to see where I have my charger kind of up and out of the way, but then I'm going to put the cable somewhere that's going to be more convenient for me because that's where I need the cable. I don't need the charger to be there because I don't need to actually access the charger physically for anything. All that's going to be done from your phone app, the Electrify America phone app. All right, so what else do we got here? So this is the this is the bracket. So this is the mounting bracket. This is what you mount to your wall. And then this is actually what goes on the, the back of this. And then you put the screws in from the side to uh, to secure this to the wall. So that's all that is the bracket. We don't need to unpack that. And then of course, this is just the hardware for those screws to, to mount to the wall and also to the mount it to that bracket. Let's go ahead and open this up real quick and see what's on the inside. All right, so let's go ahead and take this set screw out. Good job. Imagine this pops. Aha. All righty then. Okay, so that is just a, uh, a plate of sorts, just like a decorative cover. Um, it appears that we have to dive even further in with a lot more of the screws. Um, so in that case, let me run to the manual real quick. Okay, so it says remove the screw on the bottom, which we did. Uh, separate it from the middle cover. Yep, we did. Remove the screws using the T20 Torx bit. Okay, so I assume they're talking about these. This is an unboxing, so this has to be done. So let's go ahead and get this cover off and dive on in and see what's on the inside of this level two charger. The reveal. All right, and there we go. Now, I'm not gonna lift this up. I'm actually just going to uh, throw some B-roll footage in here so you can see what's on the inside. Um, but it looks like down in this corner here, you have the three wires coming from the NEMA plug on the end. Now this can be hardwired as well, so those can actually be taken out and then we can be putting in a hardwire connection into the middle of this box as opposed to what we have here. On this side, we see the connections for the actual J1772 handle charger. So that looks like that is wired into this board as well. Obviously, this looks like the control panel for the LED lights right here on the end. 
So I do see the wireless chip here, and that appears to have an antenna going into the side of the inside of the chassis here. There's also a, a network port here. I mean, I don't see why you could possibly hardwire this, but maybe that's not what it's for. Maybe it's disabled. I'm not really sure, but there is a network port on here. Right next to that is a USB port. Um, not quite sure what the USB port is for. Maybe if you had to, you know, upgrade the firmware because it was offline for some reason. I'm not really sure, but maybe that's what it is. But other than that, that's about as much as I can identify inside of this. And like I was saying, I'm going to be hardwiring mine. I'm not going to be using the NEMA plug that comes with it. And that will all be in the install video coming up soon. Well, there you go, everybody. There is the unboxing of the new Electrify America home station level two home charging system for your EV. Uh, this thing looks great. I can't wait to get this thing installed and set up. And I'm going to be showing you the process of doing that. And this is this is so beautiful. I can't wait to get this installed. Thank you very much for watching today's video. If you haven't already, hit the subscribe button to subscribe to my channel. If you like this video, hit that thumbs up button just below. You could check us out on our website, techmotoring.com, facebook.com slash techmotoring, on Twitter, at techmotoring. I'd like to thank you again for watching, and remember, welcome to the future, and welcome to techmotoring. And we will see you on the next episode.